road trip time. I'm gonna be trying on a few different pairs of nylons over the next few days. Say hi, Georgie. <laughs> and seeing how comfortable they are. Let's go. Welcome, Welcome to, to Nylons Rock. Rock. Don't forget to subscribe. You know you want to. We just got in the car and the cat has already puked. So my outfit is, uh, yeah, just a little bun, high bun over here because, yeah, you know, I'm just in a car. My nice little evil eye hoodie, isn't that cute? Some leggings with a little mesh. And my little guest shoes. I love these. I've had them for so long, I can't get rid of them. And we have some knee highs. Like them? They're kind of like a brownish, grayish color. And I think I got them at Shoppers Drug Mart, secret collection most likely. But um, I've got a few other types of panios too that I've brought some white ones. Those are Fior with Shine. I also have some Commando in Tan and some Hedoin. I have two pairs of Hedoin straight out of the box and I'm gonna try them in the next few days too. We don't know how long this trip is gonna take, but um, we're in no rush. So we're guessing probably four days because we're stopping in Atlanta to visit my family. Hi, mom. Nala. Are you having fun so far? Yeah? She doesn't look impressed. Do you think we're crazy for traveling with two cats in the car? I kind of think we're crazy a little bit, but just letting them roam around right now before we get them in their little carriers. They're gonna hate that. Don't worry, we're not driving. I like this color, and especially with my little pedicure, and you see that there's a reinforced toe over there. It's good with these um, maroon leggings, I think. So the first leg of our journey is quite uneventful. I decide to do a little bit of work on my laptop, and before we know it, we're already on the Ambassador Bridge, ready to enter the United States of America. Hi, hey, buddy. <laughs> it took about four hours to get from where we live to Michigan and although the scenery is beautiful, I am ready to uh, have some dinner. I'm ready to eat some chow, that's for sure. So I pick probably the most expensive restaurants in Ohio. I am not disappointed, that's for sure. The chop house is fantastic oh my gosh just the ambience alone i know i am completely underdressed for this occasion but that's fine i want some good food and i'm here to get it a quick washroom break just so that i can uh, show off my pantyhose <laughs> i'm guessing it's gonna be a pretty penny for this dinner but i think i'm worth it we have an amazing meal and then find the nearest hotel and yes i just jump into bed pop on the tv I think the brown nylon knee highs are really special. I don't see them around often, and even though I am more of a pale skin, I think they work really well with this ensemble. These nylons are looking pretty good. Just a full day of traveling so far. You can tell I have worn these knee highs before. I may even have worn them in a video before. Dang, yes, I have worn these before. <laughs> I picked out some light pink nylon socks today. These are some of my favorite nylons to wear. They're easy and quick when you're on the go and they're pretty comfortable. These ones are pretty sheer. They have a slight reinforced toe and I do love the shade of pink. What do you think of them? With a pair of leggings, I think that they are fantastic. These leggings are CK and uh, they're in like a tie-dye blue, gray, black. Oof. I love them. Mwah. My sheer tank top is a Nike top that I bought years ago actually and hardly ever wear so I'm excited to have it on today. I popped on a sweater because it is still cool here in Ohio. Gotta feed the cats before we hop in the car and off we go. So it's day two, we're in Ohio heading for Atlanta which we hope we will get to tonight. And, um, didn't sleep very well but um, I might get a little nap in today. Kittens are set free for a little bit so that they don't whine the whole time in their cages. But um, we're making good strides. Yay! Are there any? 
tiny Starbucks in Ohio. Waited a fucking hour for this coffee. It better be good. So yesterday I was in a pair of knee highs, which rocked, and today I'm in a pair of nylon socks. Tomorrow I will be in some pantyhose and probably a little dress, depending on the weather. It is starting to warm up. The more south we drive, the warmer it gets. So being a snowbird is really painful for me. I highly recommend it. Just say the snow made me do it. I don't know if it's my cankles or what, but these nylon socks are pretty tight and kind of digging into me today. However, I am a very big fan of this reinforced toe. Yes, I took her out for a moment, maybe a quick stop at Adam and Eve, who knows? And then I end up doing a few yoga poses in the car, dancing around because time is running very slow right now. Looks like we're in Kentucky. We're halfway there. Checking my DMs, drinking some cold coffee, and uh, yeah, rocking out just like I do. I'm sensing a theme here. Taking another pee break and um, gassing up. So we're pretty much, I would say, an hour away from Tennessee. Oh, and my nylon socks are holding up pretty good. No runs, nothing. I wore them once before, so I'm pretty happy that they haven't run yet. They're not the most expensive type of um, nylon socks, but they are cute. See? Aren't they cute? She's driving me crazy! She's driving me crazy! The scenery is beautiful and yeah, it must be Shark Week! <laughs> we get to Tennessee and ooh, we take a little stretch break, walk out to see the beautiful scenery and isn't it freaking gorgeous? We stop at Ruby Tuesdays for a lovely dinner. I actually just have a salad bar. The room is to her liking and I am so ready for bed. I was so tired last night that I fell asleep in my clothes so I just stuck with the leggings and the nylon socks that I was wearing, the little sweater on, little hat, a braid. We're gonna be in Atlanta in about three hours, so that means I get to take a nice shower, change into a pair of pantyhose. I have some white ones, brown ones, black ones, tan ones. So I will see, depending on what I pick to wear, um, which pantyhose I will be matching with my outfit. Let's get to it. Look, it's the Wacky Inflatable Tube Man. Time for a pee break and to gas up once again. How are you liking this outfit? I'm pretty comfy, not gonna lie. I head into the racetrack and look at this ice cream stand. Looks like a sausage fest. <laughs> so I'm thinking a nice little libation for tonight after we get to the hotel. How about some Mike's Hard Lemonade? Always need a little snack, so I chose some crackers, cheese, with a little bit of meat. I head back to the car, and this is what I discover. <laughs> but she's so cute. I just got carded for beer. Tells me that they want out. 
As you can tell, I'm getting a little kooky and bored and stir crazy just doing my little in the car fitness class. Okay, gotta lose the shoes. <laughs> A little yoga stretch for my hip because it is seizing up. Okay, we have a dilemma. I need to go to the washroom. Can you guess what I'm thinking? We make it to Hotlanta. The hotel is freaking gorgeous. Snack bar. It's a pretty sweet setup, not gonna lie. And I always check out the washroom because they have the best mirrors. I grab a pair of Hedolin, which is my most favorite pair of panios right now. I have a video of it. They are non-resistant, biodegradable, and comfortable as hell. Oh wait, hell is probably not very comfortable. Comfortable as heaven! The shade is nice and deep. They have an amazing little reinforced sole so it's not just the toe or the heel it's the entire sole with a beautiful little pattern on it i am in love these are fantastic are you feeling this vibe they slide on like butter super super happy that i found these pair of panios okay what do you think of these the shade the sheerness i put on a pair of little shorts and a little crop top that just fits me like a glove. Because I'm constantly cold, I put on my CK hoodie. It's a very thin hoodie tie-dye with pink and purples and whites. My Michael Kors sneakers. They're a wedge sneaker with some sparkle. I love sparkle. I am feeling this vibe. I am feeling this outfit. This is my favorite outfit so far this entire trip. Did I just see mimosas and cheesecake pancakes? All right, peeps, so I'm spilling the tea. I was a Waffle House waitress when I lived here in 1999. I had all my teeth though. Order of a medium, scattered, smothered, covered. <laughs> oh, to be 18 again. We stop off at Target just for a couple of things. And um, I haven't been to Target in a while. They try to bring it to Canada, but we were all like, boo, we like Walmart. And so they took it away. I love the bang. It's awesome. From strippers to Jesus. Seasons 52. Oh my goodness, the best salmon ever. The cool thing is, is everything on their menu is under 500 calories, yet it fills you up and it tastes delicious. And once again, we are eating, which is all good. We're at an hibachi restaurant. So my pants were super long, so I chose my highest pair of heels that I brought, and they are pretty freaking cute. And the party begins. Yes, I ordered two lobster tails because you know what? Go big or go home, my friends. The shrimp, chicken, and beef tasted so amazing as well. Okay, so uh, my Louis got a little sore, so I had to do a bit of a change and then popped on my Michael Kors once again. This is my outfit. Feeling a little more casual today. I have my pair of Hidoin. Uh, pearl, I believe the color is, and they are amazing. They are comfy, but as you can see, probably a size too big for me. 
got six and a half hours to get to Florida and we got to stop at Chick-fil-A for lunch which I haven't had since 1999 oh my gosh it is pretty tasty these guys want out and so do I oh, this has been a long long trip but we're in Florida Yes, I let him out again. It's very brief, but he's happy. The sun is setting and it is beautiful. I'm so excited to be close to home, but I'm tired AF. Good night, y'all. Don't forget to subscribe. Love ya. Ciao. Mwah.